Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. As you know that the civil department's uh, OBE software system for results have been open sourced by the chairman department of civil engineering, Professor Dr. Kasar Ali. And in order to customize it for other departments, this is a short tutorial. By the coordinator civil department, uh, engineer Fan Jamil, you already have been provided with the zip file of the software which is obsoft cd customized run on google drive so the whole system runs on microsoft office 365 being installed on your uh, teachers uh, devices or laptops or desktops and google spreadsheets or google sheets for customization from the coordinator so let's see how to set it for coordinators first of all you will first of all unzip this provided file into a folder once it is unzipped and you will open it you will find another folder called obesoft once you open it up you will see a set of few files the open source license for this software system is license gnu version 3 now you will go to your google drive as coordinator and in my drive directly will create a folder for all your obe activities for example test obe for this case after clicking create open the folder and drag all excel files and the license file into this folder once all the files are copied now you have to work on customizing administration administrators menu as well as the obe sheet in excel extract the ext excel sheet rename it for your department for example my department and open the sheet enable the contents read the license if you're interested on the sheet tabs right click and unhide database setup sheet and say ok now in main you will see this is for civil department UET Peshawar campus in database setup you can change the name of the department to your department for example my department and campus to my campus and you will see that in all sheets now the campus and department will change then in the database for all the uploaded google sheets on your google drive by these names you have to find the Google Sheet ID and paste them here. For example, for CLO of all courses Excel file, you will go to Google Drive in your OBE folder. For the file with the same name, CLOs of all courses, you will click on the share link, remove the restriction by first clicking change link to UETP shower and then if you want to keep it for all UETP shower faculty, keep it like this. Copy the link, paste it in notepad, select only the key section, copy it and in your department excel sheet for CL of all courses, paste this key. Repeat the same for all other excel files by filling up their keys. Once done, right click on this sheet and hide. Go to main sheet and click on load fresh data from coordinator's office. Then the data from your coordinator data sheets from Google Drive will get loaded for your own department. Once that is done, save this sheet, close it and right click and zip this file in with ZIP compression so every teacher can open it easily on their devices and say ok to this now drag this new file into the drive as well notice we have not copied the menu yet in the drive so open this on your laptop before loading it to drive then follow the instructions in green to create a menu for your department for example for excel file called clo of all courses we already have a link so we'll simply create a link to this clo file we already pasted the link of the file in notepad 
simply copy that select the appropriate right click link and paste the link in the address and say ok to this where a link to a cell is required for example cell d3 of batch course registration excel file from the drive as before right click the batch course registration file get shareable link make it available to UETP shower employees copy the link and in the word file this time once you select the menu item and you want cell d3 to get automatically selected right click and link and once you paste in address at the end of the address simply write ampersand range equals to the cell address which is d3 for first item and say ok to this repeat the same for all green instructions for all the files to set up this menu the last two items are provided directly from civil department UETP shower server so there is no need to attach link to them once this menu is ready save it and close this file close any windows open in drive and then drag this menu also in this folder notice these two files are accessible by faculty of your department but none of the others so make sure that all files beside the administrative menu have a sharing option to be available to all UET faculty if some of your teachers are not using UETP showers ID or simply using Gmail ID you can keep all these links available to anyone but this will create some security issues if teachers claim that they cannot that their Excel OBE system file is not working then simply apply anyone with the link option to all these files to resolve this issue let's say done to this security setting for all these files and now open the administrator menu now as you have provided these links so once you will click on this link it will take you to the place for adding editing and removing a batch so here you can add batches for example we added a batch of civil 2015 intake so you simply create a sheet by clicking this plus symbol here and once this is created at the end of its link copy the GID and in the main sheet paste it after it so for batch 2020 for example I'll say batch my department 2020 I will create a new sheet rename it to batch my department 2020 and in its link I'll copy this last GID and paste it in sheet 1 in front now this batch data will be available to all faculty members automatically whenever they will use the provided OBE Excel sheet you have to email this zip file or provide the download link to this zip file to all your faculty members where they can open it and it is already connected to your Google Sheet databases after refreshing and loading the database data teachers can fill in all yellow boxes which are typical OBE standards and then create OBE sheet by clicking generate OBE sheet button with this three new sheets will be created the review form for the course after its completion the final result with its charts and grades 
and automatically loaded student's name and registration number from coordinator's office database and the OBE sheet where they will input the student's grades. This part will automatically be filled with student data. Let me show you some dummy data. So you will be provided with the registration number and names of the students and this portion will be blank. Also the marks of a particular activity. For example, quiz one, if it is of total 10 marks, you will write 10 here. And if quiz second quiz, quest number one is having 20 marks, then you will provide maximum marks here and the attained marks, for example, following for these students down here. Once this all is filled, you will go to the result sheet and click on recalculate and on the basis of the input provided in QOB sheet, the result with GPA, grades and CLO marks will be automatically created. You can move the mean marks shown in this bell curve with the help of the division factor. The cohort attainment of CLOs for your different sections and combined will also be shown and the real distribution of student information on grades beside withdrawal, incomplete and permanently absent cases will be shown. Once rechecking has been done, the teacher can click on generate or check counseling action report. Based on the failures in different CLOs by individuals, a guide on CLO improvement will be created. For example, this candidate has fictitiously failed in CLO 3 because of all these reasons. and this particular student can be asked to submit an assignment or if you want you can change it to quiz, report, demonstration, viva or ask to repeat the whole course later based on your own decision. Then whatever activity you give them for counseling action you can call them and counsel them and then ask them to submit it for 100 marks. Now if a student come back with this assignment with certain marks the system will tell there's it has not been improved clo3 remained fail while a certain other level of attainment of marks will tell that now it has been improved so you can give multiple chances and multiple counselings of the student to eventually improve once all these improvements have been received go back to result and teacher will click on recalculate and that particular student attainment of CLO 3 will then automatically change based on the entry of marks here. Other statistics of the whole class for fail cases and repeat cases will be provided here. You can move down further and see all cases. At the end you will see the repeat cases which have no option to improve their CLOs besides just repeating. Also, for Grade Easy software and emailing every student about their case and uh, how they can improve it by submitting quiz or maybe an assignment or so, you can simply copy this all column L and the registration numbers of the students and paste them in Grade Easy software the teacher will be provided with KDZ software as well, which is available in the OBE zip folder. So you can provide the link to this file or email this KDZ software link to teachers. This tool cannot work on desktop and it has to be opened up in Google Sheets in order to work. Once the teacher has done the counseling and reproduced the final result they can save this file close it and email it to the coordinator then the coordinator will use another tool which is available from civil department UET Peshawar server for creating CMS CSV file so running this software in the same folder 
where all the received result excel sheets from the faculty is also pasted in the same folder after running this software a csv file will be created which is the format of cms in order to upload all grades for all subjects in that particular semester in this particular session this was the scope of this tutorial if you have any further queries kindly contact coordinator civil department for further help this concludes this tutorial assalamu alaikum